What's up guys? We're currently at the San Diego airport. I'm gonna be speaking at Alice Camacho's private mastermind with high level entrepreneurs. I'm currently very exhausted right now. We just finished up uh, my own event. A couple hundred people showed up. It took a lot of organization and uh, all the team to put in their efforts. So we are pretty exhausted, but super grateful for Alice Camacho flying us out there with me and my team and looking forward to bring value to everyone there. A little nervous. I yeah, get some jitters because I'm, I'm going to be the youngest person in there. I haven't spoke in a long time. I'm going to put a lot of uh, good energy into it. So hope everyone uh, enjoys it. All right, so we just came back from Alice Camacho Sunset Dinner. It was at Gannon's on a, a golf course. We had our own terrace, looking over the ocean, sunset, super beautiful. During that time, we got to network with some of the people that have been there since Monday, speakers, and we had a wonderful dinner. Now, just came back from the grocery store because we were still hungry. So you already know that we got the poke, the spamasubi, the fruits. Top off the night, I still have to prepare for my presentation and speech tomorrow so I can bring as much value as I can. So, see you tomorrow. Eating poke! Let's go! All right, so we finally arrived to Alice Camacho's property. It's on a beautiful 30,000 square foot lot and his beautiful home right behind us. Shoot, I got bit. <laughs> you gonna keep that? And today's the day that I'm gonna be speaking in front of the mastermind. So super excited for that. Hopefully I can bring a bunch of value for them and take something home. So I actually came here with another shirt. So I ended up meeting Felipe, uh, Felipe Mejia. He's a monster in real estate. We just connected, I admired his shirt. And this guy was like, do you want it? I was like, uh, are you sure? And I was like, yeah, let's just trade. I heard your comment about the shirt and it, it hit me for some reason, right? And I was like, I want you to have it. And I know you're a little hesitant, but I really, really want you to have it. But I want to tell you the story of the shirt first. Mm -hmm. So these shirts are actually called Guayaveras. Mm -hmm. They're from my home country of Mexico. And what happens is this is a worker shirt. So a worker will wear this to go out and they're just thick enough to where the sun doesn't hit them too hard and really beat on the body. But it's light enough and breathable where it's not too heavy for them to work all day. So it's a very wow. uh, custom shirt. It's kind of hand stitched in here. You'll yeah, see so it. Beautiful. You can see the, the side here, so I really want you to have it. Wow. Now we're going to do a little jersey swap. <laughs> there you go. Oh my gosh, that's you all day, bro. All right, now we just finished the first session of the speakers. Uh, Felipe was actually my favorite speaker uh, for the first part. He talked about how to take out line of credit three times on one property, which is amazing and blew my mind. We're also on break for lunch. And after that, it's gonna be my turn to speak. I'm gonna be the first one up for the second half. So I have to get into the mindset of speaking. There's actually a private chef that's cooking all of this and I'm about to try their tacos. So this is the guac and chicken. Oh no! <laughs> that's pretty good. That's good. That's some fresh guac. All right, now we gotta fix that. <laughs> In 2017, I started my first digital marketing agency. So that's where I learned about marketing, right? My business tanked, but it opened up another opportunity with real estate. I told myself I will post 30 days straight starting December 1st, 2022. So this was a little over four months ago. I put six years of my marketing knowledge to work. 
So seven days later, I went from 1,000 followers to 100,000. Today's day three. Yesterday, we, we just finished up all the speakers with the keynote speaker being Brandon Turner. He was definitely my favorite speaker of the day. He was talking about the mindset that you have to go into your business. So there's four different mindsets. There's a do-it-yourself mindset, a project manager mindset, COO mindset, and an architect mindset. So all of these naturally progress, but the one that you wanna be on is the architect. You wanna be the energy of your company. You want to be the person that's casting out the vision and getting everyone to where they need to be because that is the most important spot for you and your business to grow. It spoke volumes to me because in my business, I get stuck in the, the DIY and project management where I really should be the architect. The direction is the most important part. So that's what I have to focus a lot more on. For the guys that don't know who Brandon Turner is, he's one of the the, the legends in the real estate space. He, I believe he um, is one of the co-founders of Bigger Pockets or the main podcast host. A lot of people know who he is, he's a big deal. He also owns almost a billion dollars under management with his company, Open Door Capital. So there's a lot to learn from this guy. We got some poke from Foodland once again, because it is fire. <laughs> Later on, we're gonna be meeting up with them at Monkey Pod to get lunch again and all the other activities with the, with the crew. So this guy right here, his name is Jake Villarreal. His real name is Jacob. But uh, this guy is the one that keeps me in line and makes sure everything is going to place. He's my manager. All right, so I'm gonna try this Hawaiian raw crab. I've tried the Korean ones. Uh, when it was uh, over there, it looked really cool. Let's try it. Tastes like nothing and something at the same time. More of nothing and just spicy. Six out of 10. All right, so we just made it to Monkey Pod. It's supposed to be one of the best restaurants here on the island of Maui. Alex and the crew are all the way down here. And we're, we're just here networking, having a good time, sharing some stories as well. Let's dig in. So I got the ahi steak. He said this is the best one on the menu, so I, got, I had to get it. <laughs> so I got this Mai Tai too. It's supposed to be the best Mai Tai in Hawaii. Uh, 10, the last, for the past 10 years. It's super good. All right, so we're at Ulani's. It's one of the best shaved ice on Hawaii and probably in the world. That's what, at least that's what they say. So I got the Malona and Ube. Ube is a seasonal flavor. Very excited. I got some lihi moi on top and some condensed milk and I'm about to dig in. Try this ube first. Yo, that is good. Try the, this one? Yo, that is pretty good, man. And we waited one hour for this thing right here and it's way worth it. All right, so we're at Big Beach right now with the man of the hour, the guy that put together this whole amazing event. Alex man, Camacho, Josh. man. Dude, amazing event, man. This mastermind truly gave me a lot of new perspective in my business and in my life, man. So what, what's your reflection of the whole week? I think the first one is just a proof of concept. We've been, we've been wanting to do some type of event like this at this uh, magical property estate. I mean, this thing's a huge, um, house and has a big lot and it's close to some of the best beaches in the world. I've experienced 
retreats kind of like this, and masterminds, and so I've been wanting to do it for a while and to finally pull it off and for all of it to, to tie in together and everybody to get value and um, no major problems. Uh, I'm super happy, man. So what, what's the next step, man? So uh, next step, I'm gonna be uh, hopping over to the other island, Oahu, uh, this weekend because I have a house over there that I'm keeping. It's uh, fortunately also got a great deal on it, right on the water. Yeah. I'm gonna do a final punch list. After that, going back to LA where I'm speaking at WealthCon, I know you're gonna be there, so I can't wait to see you there. Yeah. It'll be a couple days we won't see each other, but then back in LA, baby. Yes, sir. Well, uh, you worked hard and put out an amazing event. It's time to chillax on this beach now, right? That's time to take a nap, take yeah. a swim. All of it. All right, thank you, brother. All right, brother.